Good morning, guys. How are you? Good to see you. We're here at Performance Bike. We are taking off today. It's Sunday. We are heading out, and uh, we got the bike packed up, ready to go. Check it out. Look at this. We got the flag. We're all good to go. We got the smoky, great smoky mountain, Tennessee license plate. And uh, I mounted my tires actually on top. So uh, Ed told me it could hold about four pounds. So uh, three to four pounds. So we're going to test that out today. It's got a little sway in it, but uh, I'm excited to see how it goes. Anyway, we got uh, day number 28. We're ready to rock and roll. We're gonna head to Sanford, North Carolina today. Let's get it. <laughs> today, look at Bella. Bella, say hello. Hello. Hello, YouTube. Yeah, she just sat on the bike. She loved it. She had so much fun. She's got a picture. We're gonna put the picture up too. And uh, Performance Bicycle has been everything and more that we needed. So I appreciate you guys. Thank you for helping us out. And uh, everything that we needed from you guys and a lot more and ex ex excitement as well. So that's what we're worry about today. This canopy is awesome. I'm so glad I got this. Thank you, Ed. <laughs> something major occur on the bike the canopy oh man it's bad wallet fell out full of business cards out of the rack <gasps> I gotta take a detour. I think I have to go up there. And if I can get up onto that, then I should be okay. Because this is this is all closed over here. Because uh, I guess it's been closed for a while, not due to the storm or anything. Just want you guys to know I'm being responsible. I could have just climbed this hill and tried it, but I'm not going to. It's a little hill, but I'm not gonna do it. You know why? Because I got some nice stuff on here now, and I don't want to break it. So that's is. Uh, I'm gonna push it up. Oh crap. I'm gonna push it up and uh, we'll be good to go. Dad, Walton Woods Senior Living Center. That's where you're going. Look at that. It's like a mansion. Yeah. I don't know if you guys that don't know, my dad is actually, uh, he's a little older. Quick story. He's uh, 87, I think he is now. And uh, he's been in and out of the hospital. He's getting to that age and it's tough to watch and he doesn't quite have Alzheimer's, but he's very stubborn, just like I am. Turn right. Thank you. And so he, Sometimes when I talk about living homes, senior living homes, 
all the time. He doesn't like it. He wants to live on his own. He thinks he can still do it. He has a hard time. Anybody else deal with that with friends or family members or grandparents or parents that, you know, they get older and they just think that they can still do it, but they can't? Because this is what's happening to me right now. I mean, I bet if I showed him this place, though, wow, he'd be all about it. Shorter, shorter days, so I'm gonna stop for a quick lunch at uh, Wendy's just because I need something fast, and then I gotta head out the door and get out of here. So we're heading to Sanford. I still got, I still have another um, 40, 50, another 50 miles to go. No, 47, 47 miles to go. We got an extra water. In five hours, they're gonna get one there. So we got. So we're currently uh, just going through Cary. I think this is Apex, I'm not sure. But I've seen a lot of signs for Cary, but I just wanna show you guys the road that uh, we're riding on. You guys have just seen a lot of the trail. Super nice trails around here, super nice people. And uh, these lanes are pretty wide. It ends, but they do have a sidewalk. You really need to get up there and you don't like riding on the road can always go on the sidewalk I don't mind riding on the road I feel pretty comfortable but uh, if anybody wants to you can always get up there on the road so I mean up on the uh, sidewalk so one of the cool things about the canopy is that up above there is a uh, up there it's just velcroed on and as you can see the Sun is just to my left so all I really have to do right now is that I can do this one-handed, undo it, put it down, grab my handle. So it's very easy to use, and now the sun's out of my eye. Uh, do a little update on the uh, on the actual um, the fang. So basically, what's happening is this thing. There's no drag on it. There's no uh, like basically this isn't creating any drag. There's nothing that's actually keeping it from uh, like the wind. It's windy as heck right now. So the wind outside, like going down hills, isn't affecting it whatsoever. So basically, it's uh, it's what happens. The worst that happens. I gotta turn my light off. Is it goes down a little bit. But when it bends down, it actually, the air goes up over the top. So as you guys can see, I have my tires on top. And uh, yeah, it's riding good. The Bafang is also riding good. Uh, level five assist, uh, level four uh, and five is what I'm cruising at. And then level three is where I'm at for um, taking off from, from a dead stop. So yeah, so that's, uh, that's where we're at right now with the canopies. And I'm telling you guys right now, the wind today is, is crazy. This thing sways back and forth. Look, it sways. But the way he makes this and the way the product is, is like, it's just super, super nice and it's strong. 
Like it's just very strong. So yeah, I'm giving this thing an A plus today and probably for the rest of the trip. So. Eight miles or so to go. And Tom Mercier is actually gonna meet me. He is another uh, recumbent trike owner. He's gonna ride with me. He's uh, riding up right now to uh, meet me wherever I end up. We meet in the middle. And he's gonna ride back to the hotel. We're gonna grab some dinner. Very excited. Anybody else wants to ride, man, please let me know. I'll be getting uh, the western part of South Carolina. I'll also be, uh, I'll be down by, into Georgia by Atlanta. And then I'll be going across once I, once I get down to Georgia, I'm going to be cutting across, making the cut across west. So let me know if you're in those states and any of those areas, and I'll let you know if I'm going to be in that area. I'd love to ride with people because it gets boring as heck riding by yourself. Okay, we're going to go catch uh, Mr. Mercy right now. Just flew by me. I was at the wrong hotel. I went by my hotel, and now he's in front of me. He was moving. So now, we're gonna rip right by him. It's gonna be awesome. I told Mel the wrong hotel. The first hotel I told him I ended up, it canceled out, I remember now. So I'm sorry, that's my bad. And then, so I just got the directions. We went to, I went to the hotel, the Cono Lodge, I originally said, so that was my bad. That was on me. Oh, well, we're riding now. We got like three miles left of the other hotel, so we're cruising. So we met up with Tom and uh tom actually just rode up and i told him the wrong place that i was he was at the right place but uh i had gotten taken because i gave the wrong address so that was my fault but uh anyway we're here with tom uh mercier is that you say yep. so tom mercier and uh he's actually from connecticut which is awesome and he's driving down to florida right now and uh met me in sanford so thank you i appreciate You're that welcome. and uh he was riding so i uh, just rode the last like four miles and to the hotel and now we're gonna get some food so i'm gonna let you guys go and hopefully you enjoyed that vlog that was day 28 uh, this is Tom again. If you check him out, do you have any pages that we can go check out? I have a Facebook page. You have a Facebook page yep. we can go check out? What's it called? Yep. Just Tom Mercier. So just M -E -R -C -I -E -R. Tom Mercier, M E R C I E R, right? Yep. Tom Mercier. And I'll put that in the video too so you guys can check it out. He's got a page. Tom actually toured across the U.S. He went from where to where? From Rhode Island to Santa Monica Pier. Holy shit. <laughs> Rhode Island to Santa Monica Pier, which is 3,850 miles. And 50 miles. 3,850. Yeah, right. I won't. I'll have, I'll have 400 miles less than that, but uh, that's awesome. But he, he didn't have a motor on his. He just used his leg. So, uh, but again, it's, that's a, an accomplishment. So I'll be able to, uh, I'll be able to hopefully get some tips from him before, uh, before he heads out. But I will see you guys later. This day 28. Love you guys. Stay happy. Stay humble. And I'll see you later. Make somebody smile too. Simple. Smile at him. See you guys. Bye.